Have you heard about superior OS? Probably yes. And if yes, simply check out the new things, the new features which we got in this latest version available officially for some of the devices and available unofficially for a few of the devices. As I always say, check out XDA or device telegram groups or channels if you have the latest update available. We're talking about the latest version, which is based on Android 12.1. Of course, basically Android 12L, the July security patch is what we have. As I'm using unofficial version, you can also try out unofficial version for the device if it is available. It will give you the Android 12L style Easter egg as expectedly as a lot of customers are using this right now. And yes, it's not official by the way. Officially, Google does not give you this kind of Easter egg. It has only simple Android 12 kind of things. Moving on to the default launcher, what we have in the default launcher is all apps themed icons, which you already know about this one. This is what we have. If you have the apps which support themed icons, the Abra will look quite good, but unfortunately it's not like that so far. Same like that if I move on to the other options, for example, if I move on to settings once again, we also got the icon rack support. You can even resize the icons if you want to. Home screen has the same kind of options, double tap to sleep. We have some status bar things. You can even enable the Google search bar in the bottom if you have the google app installed but nothing else after also has some few of the customizations as i just saw let me show you as the row height customizations you also have the option for background opacity which you can simply increase or decrease if you want to and if i move on to the recents option you have the option to use the grid style which is actually quite good let me just check it out as you can see this is how it is looking like and you can even adjust the background opacity if you want to which actually looks quite good it was about this recent customizations which you have in this default launcher the default launcher is basically superior os launcher it's not rebuchet it's not pixel it's not launcher or else it is a, maybe a superior os launcher is what you have if i move on to the quick settings panel what you have in quick settings panel is white background as expectedly some few of the extra tiles options available as you can see flashlight etc i will not recommend to use the combined internet tiles simply use the separate wi-fi and mobile data tiles because the combined internet tile is not working fine i tried and i found some bugs there so i will recommend you to use the separate ones uh, like not like all custom rooms but this room has the wallpaper apps pre-installed which means you will see some few of the wallpapers by default but these are superior walls which means these are only for this room or basically you can say that this room has this this room kind of wallpapers available that will not give you some extra wallpapers or the wallpapers which does not have the superior OS logo or text and this is what we have available you can use this wallpaper app if you want to you can apply any of these wallpapers very easily you can even download and you can even apply it's up to you some few of the customizations which are included in this superior settings ui is actually changed and if i'm not wrong i didn't made a video yet on superior os so this is what we have some ui changes if you are able to notice customization status bar quick settings customizations are basically same like all the other custom homes we also found same kind of things here too if i move on to the customization section we got some monet customizations which means you'll be able to use the force black theme or you'll be able to use the custom colors if you don't want to use the wallpaper based theming you can use any other we also got some font customizations and of course one of my favorite is google sense and a lot of guys love this thing icon pack of course has some pui oxygen os and same kind of things available which you might get in almost all the custom homes right now so nothing unique here but yes in the terms of smoothness superior os might be quite superior for you because it also has a vanilla version available you can install google apps separately and uh, most of the times if you use a vanilla version the room is quite smooth we also have the data usage summary option available in the quick settings footer if you want to enable that you can and if you're able to notice let me show you one more thing in gestures we have hold for assistant we got one handed mode that's also present if you want to i mean all the useful gestures are already present even the three finger swipe gesture is also there double tap to sleep on status bar and lock screen that's also present here and if i move on to the system navigation option if you're able to notice the navigation bar pill which is basically kind of ios it's not actually from the ios one it's not the default aosp one but the kind of navigation bar pill is what you get in android 13 beta 3 
and yes this kind of pill is by default included in this version too same like that if we move on to some customizations we got some miscellaneous options where you can use the ripple effect option window secure flags ignore if you want to take screenshots in restricted apps you can use that other than those things are basically same these are the things which you have in this superior OS. I got some official word devices. The link for available devices is already available in the description. And if your device is an official version, as I always say, check out XD or Telegram channels. This is all. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.